she had no fear. So that's how she was. So Paula wasn't entirely surprised when her daughter Holly showed an interest in the military. She went from being a cadet to being the A Company commander. And uh, it was in 10th grade that she told me that she wanted to join the, uh, the Army. In 2004, Private First Class Holly Magoo was stationed in Iraq, living her dream when suddenly it all ended. Holly was just 19 years old. Her vehicle rolled over an IED, and all three of them in her vehicle were, um, they, all three of them died. Devastated and distraught, Holly's mother soon came up with a way to honor her daughter, a personalized license plate with Holly's nickname, Willie. And she had these really chubby thighs, and I would be changing her diaper or something, and I would take her legs, and I would just say, Holly, Bolly, Wally, Willie, and Willie stuck. Fast forward to 2004, the year Holly was killed. The Secretary of State actually sent me W-I-L-L-Y, and I probably had it for maybe three months, and then received a letter that somebody else had that plate in Michigan, so they had to, have, they had to replace it. So, um, W-1-L-L-Y. But now, all these years later, the Secretary of State is refusing to issue Paula a new duplicate plate. Like, it's peeling, and I know I'm gonna get pulled over because you can't, you obviously cannot read that it's even W-1-L-L-Y. Paula received a form letter stating the Secretary of State will not issue personalized plates that are considered obscene. I said to Bruce, I said, I don't understand. What's offensive with W-1-L-L-Y? Willie can be a person's name, but it's also a slang word for male genitalia. The Commerce Township mother wrote a handwritten letter to the Secretary of State. W-1-L-L-Y is for my daughter, my hero, and the only female KIA in Operation Iraqi Freedom from Michigan. But all she got back was a duplicate form letter. I'm angry. I'm hurt. I lost my daughter. She did something very brave. Small way for me to honor her, you know? I'm proud, and I want people to know that. Now, Paula says all she wants is a brand new duplicate plate so she can continue to honor her daughter. We, of course, reached out to the Secretary of State, but we have not heard back yet. Camila Mary on the Edge.